Fala galera, tranquilo? Estou aqui no início do vídeo para convidar todos vocês para participar da nossa comunidade Aleartes, um grupo relacionado especialmente para CSGO. Vamos trocar bastante ideia sobre o jogo, sorteios, lobbies, mix com a galera e outras novidades exclusivas para todos que estiveram no grupo. Então não perde tempo, é de graça e infelizmente as vagas são limitadas. Link vai estar na descrição do vídeo, basta descer a tela aí e entrar, fechou? Vejo todos vocês lá, é nóis guys! Overstack A or, you know, take over stairs quickly. Oh boy! He's gonna hang on to that smoke for now. Picks up an early kill. Ooh, but Bolts and Cello bring it back in grim, labored effort to get Bolts down. It's a very slow flank here from Fang. Put your silencer on. <laughs> Might actually be useful in this position. You're literally on a flank from long yeah. with an unsilenced USP. I, uh... This would be funny. I mean, if he shoots, it makes a lot of noise, and he gets the instant turnaround. <laughs> oh, okay. Turns out the gun still works. Yeah. Bullets are bullets. Two versus two off the Fang's flank. Vinny. Youch. Run right oh, through him. Alzark let him go. Oh, insta gush as well. Vinny's gonna get his impact. Three kills in the pistol, and that's a name. Two we scout tags, had. as you said. 15 on the clock at this point. Fang will get blasted by bolts. And now it comes down to the CZ and the MP9 of Grim inside the corner. Him and JT lay it down. Back behind the truck, no chance at the plant. Floppy just has to survive, and they have done it. Complexity, a speed bump too big. And got teammates like Floppy. That is true. Fire on the feet. Uh oh. Flash in the face. AK from Cello drops Floppy. Clean second headshot onto JT. Back to reality. Holzerk's MP9 has been a constant nuisance for Imperial, coming at them from all sorts of angles. He gets an AK upgrade, but Imperial wastes no time with that. As soon as Complexity would take a step forward into their just regular aggression to retake map control, Imperial ready for a full attack. But there's JT on the hunt. Damn. Showing they're still comfortable trying it. And as much as I want to paint Halzerk as like the key piece to Inferno, JT was doing the same thing on that first map, right? Peeking down Banana, having Floppy or Grim behind him, setting him up. Great shot up into Connector. Floppy, though, flashed yet again. And JT falls right after this two-man monster hit, serving up problems. Halzerk oh. flies out from heaven. Molly on his feet. Oh, but he snaps onto Fallen to stop that bomb. Won't survive in smoke, however. Boosting. This could get weird if all of a sudden the short hit yeah, comes through. They're way through. ahead of this, so... They disassemble, but JT falls right Ooh. down into Jota, prepared for that. Halzerk, M4 point blank. They're trying to hold off on Monster. Can they finally hang on? Halzer able to stop the short push. Beautiful wall bank from Cello. And he turns it up a notch. Fallen point blank. Fantastic. Wow. They Fantastic. Done. I can't believe that. Any one more kill. And then, of course, it's pretty much over there for Imperial. But Cello has just done so much as a B opener. Nine kills for him. A new name to talk about in this series. Through balloons. And JT's got everything covered here. Now, this relies on a really slow default. Anything fast towards B, of course, is, is death, but we are getting that default coming through. Perfectly timed setup from Complexity. Yeah, it's the only difference, actually. Hauser should be watching Balloons, I think, but he's holding deep into mid. And yeah. I don't even know how he dies. That's a miscommunication or a misunderstanding as to who's got what. Recoverable. If Grim can come up with another one, has to be cautious as the presence is very much known, but like you said, it's that B play that it means death for Complexity. And Imperial had bolts, feeling it out. Floppy falls off heaven, still recovers with a headshot. Cello will find Grim, looking to go join that bomb on Fallen. Dropped gun. Still, he's alive and kicking. Oh, Fallen just comes forward in this. Floppy needs assistance. He tries to turn it back, and Fallen serving up the distraction, but Floppy's locking this in. Down to 35 health. Cello to the 1v2. Kills the close. What? Turns. turns it on complexity to 10. Damn. Dude, from that spot on short, he's going to have that sandbag named after him. Here. If only this is one of those rounds where they've got guns. Shadow advantage here for Grim. First one's clean. Loses his first teammate, still more of them to work off of. They go for the wide swing to set up Grim, and he uses that chance wonderfully. Still trying to hold it off. Tons of damage done. Enough for Halzerk to come through with this clutch. No kit, but close. Though smoke could be his problem. And the Deagle just gets away from him, Fallen having that. 
Uh, JT 5v4. A fourth round. In the grand scheme of things, could maybe end up making a massive difference. Because Counter-Strike is the eternal tale of two halves. These teams know each other very well. On this map specifically. Complexity's T-sides are always their better half when these two teams meet. You know, there are lifelines for you to be grabbing onto if you are spectating this at the moment. For like a sad North American right now and you yeah. want to know why Complexity may win. If you're leaning over your keyboard with a tear in the corner of your eye thinking you wanted to go to Washington to watch Floppy play on LAN, well, you got to keep believing. Just like Jota and Fallen in this two versus five. Because a 2v5 to close this T side would really be a massive nail in the proverbial coffin. Oh Fallen is taking God. that bomb and he is Way running to back to B forward. where everybody else has left. JT got one player down here. JT, you need to stop this. And Fallen okay. will die for survive here for complexity. It's a death. That happened over on Inferno last time these teams met. But now it's overpass that ends up being the biggest blowout so far. Mm. This game is not over. Collect your energy. The collective prey for Complexity's hopes. Shredded oh, by Berettas. Wow, good night. See ya. Not in Washington. Tapping away at their heels. Vinny will finally, fin 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 finally finish off Paul Zerk. <laughs> and Floppy right there with him. Oh, Cello, just complete the farm. I mean, we talked about you all throughout that first half, and now three players at low HP. No confidence left over. Ready to be mauled. Grim takes one down. Shell going to clear out long in a second. Maybe join back into this fight. We'll see. Here they are in the fishbowl. Surrounded by hungry Brazilians. Jota tucked in. Dodges the flash. Grim's going. Yeah, eats the bullet. Long peak, however, shut down by Cello. So he's made his presence known again, having wrapped back around bathrooms. Grim locked into the left side of Dumpster. Vinny will eventually come back up here or wait long enough. Oh, JT's Deeg. We've been waiting. Waiting for that, too. And it's an upgrade into the Fomus. It's a lifeline for Complexity's T-side. If yet again, after losing Pistol, they can successfully force right back. And sure enough, success in this one. It is only Cello left, bomb beyond the halfway point, and he concedes it. Complexity in back-to-back -back halves. Lose pistol only. So like everybody recognizes, okay, we're we're back into the real game. Yeah, this is suddenly a real game scoreline. Just a good lead for Imperial. Oh, on the one-for-one -one trade inside of blue. Critical trade. Yeah. That does keep things alive. Oh, but he gets traded through the wall. However, one back on the... B-side player. There's two more, however. They've brought about Vinny. Yes, sir. Down by Monster. Vinny pops up. Complexity side. Halzerk, one on three. Oh! Whoa. <laughs> you know, the first guy, and then, yeah. and then the wood wall player. Yeah, was playing deeper. Silver lining. Guns again, and JT finds a quick entry. That okay. could have easily been a cello opening. We know how hot he's been shooting. It is still a bunch of damage to two of Complexity's players. But it's a 5v4 and a little map control, although Imperial aren't far away. They are not shying back. Oh my god, the call GT out. GT through smoke. And now Fallen's going to try the same game. And why would they expect there to be another player right there? Oh, Fallen, yeah. if he doubles back towards short, as Bolts draws attention away from Long, he is in the thick of it. We said he hasn't seen much action despite this battlefield. Well, now... He tries to take down Grim and pays the ultimate cost. Mm. Vinny, the last man up, 1v3. Okay, Molly, I think. Um, but he's actually oh. not going to use it. They're gonna Just through the wall. Both other players out long. Vinny's falling back. And they almost line up. The execs light on Util as well. Molly comes here onto the ramp. It's emphasis out from Monster. We'll see how close to the site they can truly get with Vinny down in water. Oh, Grim, leave it to him. Sometimes when push comes to shove, it's Grim to cut the heads off. And again, he comes through. Wow. Triple headshot from Grim. And a fallen clutch queued up. Grim to the left, one inside sight. And there's the double. Last frags versus Fang gets the peak, but Fang to take the clutch. Another close for Fang, and yes, he doesn't. He's making a bit of sound, so this activity's heard. Somebody's better be holding this. 
A missed shot from Halzerk. If JT is not there. Yeah, I think he was blind. Jotzi. JT on Joda. Gets away. But damn, man. Halzer takes a ton of damage in that as well. So Joda, worth it for sure. We start to get this work back towards the B site from Complexity. There's been no activity out of them in this direction. Cello op. He waits. And he nails the first one. Gets away on 4 HP. Leads them right into Vinny. Who then postures up. Missed shot from Cello. A chance to Complexity to push. And JT oh, fumbles because Vinny this time locks it all right in. Oh. oh, and that's not just the kill. That's information. Grim down. Dude, Vinny has been the bane of their existence. Lights out plays from him. Oh, it's a double in from Floppy, but Bolts, he's got the short side. And that is Imperial. Their CT side, simply not enough. Cello's going to open up. Contact's been found. Floppy, just like last round, trying to keep complexity in this. An attempt to get them at this A site. Joda, head on a swivel, turns it back around, nade in front, but again, it is Floppy fighting tooth and nail. With his hands now busy on the bomb, oh. the coverage is out from Halzerk, working only with the scout. And a missed shot allows these CTs to get their retake rolling. Floppy the one-man army just cannot do it on his own. And we hoped for the JTD ground, but with 25 health, it is heartbreak for complexity yet again. Rounds away from beating Navi to qualify directly to Washington. And now instead that dream is dead. Taken by Imperial.